With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let us solve this question. The question says that N factor of HCl in the given reaction is K2Cr2O7 plus HCl gives KCl plus CrCl3 plus Cl2 plus H2O. Option A 1, Option B 6, Option C 7 by 3, Option D 3 by 7. So in this question a reaction is given, we have to find out the N factor of HCl. Right, so first of all we will balance this equation, then we will find out the number of electrons which will be involved in this reaction or you can say the number of electrons which one mole of HCl will lose. Right, so here we have K2. Cr2O7, it reacts with HCl to form KCl plus CrCl3 plus Cl2 plus H2O. So, let us balance this equation. As you can see on reactant side, we have two potassium atom, but on product side, we have only one. So, we will write down the coefficient 2 in front of KCl. Right, to equalize the potassium atom on both sides. And on reactant side, we have 2 chromium, but on product side, we have only 1. So, again, we write 2 here. If we count oxygen on reactant side, we have 7 oxygen, but on product side, we have only 1. So, we will write 7 here. Now, if you see hydrogen, on reactant side, we have 1 hydrogen, but on product side, we have 7 into 2, 14 hydrogen. So, we will write 14 here. Right. So, now, if you calculate the chlorine, on reactant side we have 14 chlorine, on product side we have 2 chlorine from here, 2 into 3, 6 chlorine from here and 2 chlorine from here. So, total here we have 2 plus 6 plus 2. Total we have 10 but we need 14. So, what we will do? We will write 3 here. Right. So, now we have 3 into 2, 6 and here also we have 6 and here we have 2. So, total we have 14 chlorine now. So, now this reaction is balanced. Now, if you find out the oxidation state of chromium in K2Cr2O7, let oxidation state of chromium is X. We have 2 potassium here. So, 2 into plus 1 because oxidation state of potassium is plus 1. Plus 2X because we have 2 chromium atom. Plus 7 into we have 7 oxygen atom and charge on each oxygen is minus 2. So, it will be equal to 0. So, from here we get 2 plus 2x minus 14 equal to 0. So, from here 2x will be equal to 14 minus 2 that is 12. Right. So, x will be equal to 12 by 2 that is plus 6. So, here chromium is present in plus 6 oxidation state. Now, if you see CrCl3, here we have let oxidation state of chromium is X and we have 3 chlorine, so 3 into minus 1 equal to 0. So, here X will be equal to plus 3. So, here chromium is present in plus 3 oxidation state. So, as you can see, here the decrease in oxidation state is from plus 6 to plus 3. But if you see here we have 2 chromium and here also we are getting 2 chromium, right? So, if we consider 2 chromium, then there is change in oxidation state from plus 12 to plus 6, right? It means there is gain of 6 electrons, there is gain of 6 electrons. So, so here number of electrons involved is 6, right? So, here we have 14 moles of HCl, 14 moles of HCl loses, loses 6 electron because if you see in HCl we have minus 1 charge on chlorine but in Cl2 we have 0 charge on chlorine. So, it means 6 chlorine atom loses 6 electrons. So, 1 mole of HCl will lose 6 by 14 electron. And it will be equal to 3 by 7 electrons. Right. So, 1 mole of HCl loses 3 by 7 electron. 
So here three by seven is the n factor. So option D will be correct. Three by seven is the n factor. So option D is the answer. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.